Hello everyone, thank you for joining Remote Sensing and JS Question and Answer Session Series. In today's question, we'll see how we can able to export this shape file into Excel sheet. So I'm having an attribute table, okay? And there are multiple shape files are there, okay? And there is some information in each attribute table is there. So here I'm having OSM ID. So I have downloaded this data from OpenStreetMap. So how to download the data from OpenStreetMap? For that, you can visit our channel Vikas Gadamode. In that, you will get many videos how you can able to download the OSM data. After that, downloading the OSM data, you can able to convert this shape file into Excel sheet data. In the previous videos, I have shown how you can able to convert Excel file data or CSV file data into shape file. But today we are going to see how we can able to export this shape file, multiple shape files. Okay, I'm having multiple shape files and I'm export them at a time in a single click i want to export all this data into excel sheet or csv file format so if you'll see i'm having line data point data and polygon data and every data having some attribute information okay so these are the water water based data and if you'll see there is a different different attributes are there so if you want to export a single file into csv file you can right click and then you can click on the export and save feature as and from here you can export a single file okay if you want to export a single file into excel sheet or any format you can able to export but i'm interested to export this into one single click so for that what we can able to do we can able to install this scm js plugins in that there is a batch converter is there and from vector format how we can able to convert to excel file that we are going to see but before that you can install these plugins from manage and install plugins and here you need to add scmjs plugins so in previous videos i have already shown how you can able to add so scmjs plugin is there and in this plugin you can able to install after installing these plugins we just need to click on scmjs batch converter vector format converter so we need to add our shape files and then it will convert to csv file so all this shape file we can able to add so just need to go to browse option is there and in the browse option in the video lecture i have one folder in that folder shape file to csv file is there and in the shape all these files are there if i'll go back i will show you in the video lecture there is a shape file csv and in the shape all the files are there like a building land use then natural then point railway roads so all these files are here waterways then roads railway lines then buildings so what we need to do we just need to click on the browse option and then need to select this folder okay and just click on the select folder so you will see all the files will show here that building then land use then natural railway i am selecting all the files and after that just need to click on the apply so after i am clicking on the apply all the file will automatically convert into excel file format so it is converting so eight files are there at a time eight files i'm converting into excel sheet file format or csv file format so successfully it is converted now i will open the folder now here you will see csv file is added here so just click on the file on the buildings you will see there are three things was there in the attribute table one is osm id then name and type so if i'll close this i will go to qgis right click open attribute table you will see osm id name and type after that this land use file is there in the land use file there is again three type is there osm id name and type again we can go to the folder and here is the land use. 
So this land use we have converted in a single click. We have exported this. So after that, you can able to see other files as well. This is the point data is there in the point data. If I'll right click open attribute table, you will see the OSM ID and type is there. So you can go to here and you can able to see the point shape file is there. So this way very easily we can able to convert our shape file into CSV file format. So if you are having number of shape files, if you are having hundreds of shape file, you can add in a one folder. And after adding a one folder, you just need to click on the batch converter. And in a single click, you can able to export this multiple shape files into CSV file formats. So if you have any doubts, you can ask me in the comment sections and I will provide you a link in the description box where you can able to download this data sets. And if you have any doubts, you can ask me in the comment sections. Thank you.